Hudson, who we saw earlier today on the uneven bars, currently in fifth position with 9.55. And Trisha's mounting from the side of the beam. The gymnast can mount from whichever end or side of the beam they prefer, and she mounted with an oblique angle. Demonstrated a nice press to handstand and a good flexibility hand arabesque. Oh dear, what a pity. That was a gain of flick flack and she's lost her balance and will lose 0.5 for that fall. Actually, Francis, that movement would have what's called bonus value in that it's very rarely seen in competitive gymnastics. So it's a shame she did lose her footing. And now a round off, she's in trouble. She's in trouble again. You can see why with the previous performer, Carolyn Stewart, we said it's so important for their confidence that they stay on. Now she's down one whole mark. In fact, she's not showing the confidence she exhibited the other day. Beam is one of her strong events. And here is that very unique movement. Oh, and she stumbled there too a little. A small wobble. Possibly about a point two of a point deduction. So that movement across the beam, that aerial cartwheel across the beam, has what's called bonus value. As their routines are judged out of 9.7, they get additional marks for rare, that is, original movement. A double twist dismount, a poor routine for Fisher 14.